Um, I'll give you a link in the comments or the uh, description up, up in the corner. But um, yeah. So um, basically, and then in Time Machine, I have I've never even opened it yet because. I haven't done it, but for laptop users, um, you have to have it obviously plugged in every hour, and if you don't, obviously you won't like try and back it up. I'd probably ask you to plug it in, but so yeah, it's mostly used for um, desktop users, so just have it plugged in. But I, I think it's a really good application. You know, I mean, then you you don't have to like go back to exact what you had a um, a uh, like a month ago. And because like a month ago I had Tiger, so <laughs> I don't want to do that. So I'm gonna actually use Time Machine. I'm not sure because then in Time Machine, you once you open a Finder window and you go in Time Machine, it'll take you back to that Finder window the last time you um something changed in it, and then you can just click Restore and you got your file back. Um, you can also go by date or just by day or anything. Um, let me go back to here. Let me go back here. Um, system preferences, um, where is it? Time Machine. It's got a love this icon, I don't know about you, but I really like it. So, like I said, I'm probably going to use Time Machine in the future, <laughs> um, when I, um, sort of learn exactly more what it is, um, let me think, I really don't think there's much else to, oh wait, I almost forgot something, hang on. See if you take your window, and move it by the dock, it's really cool, reflective dock. Um, oh yeah, I almost forgot them as well. Really cool, new screen savers. Let's go in here, let me see, now I'm going to drag this to a different space. This one's called Arabsq, I have no clue how to spell, spell it, but it's just what it looks like. Um, so uh, you can see in the bottom there I have my a clock. And this is a really cool screensaver. And the clock every minute moves around to a different spot so you don't get burned in if you're in a plasma or something. Then you have your original computer name and stuff. And stuff. But then you have a really stupid one. I don't know who came up with doing this. A word of the day. Like, do you really care about this stuff? <laughs> Who's going to care? Um, there's one another one called Shell. I kind of like it a little bit, you know. Not as much as that other one I showed you, but... You know, this one uh, works. Well, it's kind of mesmerizing. I just stare at it for a while. But anyway, um, got a couple of new desktop pictures also. You got, uh, so you can see the one I have. You got a zebra and I got the earth. And yeah. So, I think that's basically it. So yeah, as always, if you have any questions about this video or anything you would want me to add in another video, um, type a comment down there. Um, I check them like every day or so, and I'll either reply or if it's something really big, I'll make a whole other video for it. And yeah, thanks for watching. Orange Guitar Guy 118 signing off.